Holidays are fun, but they can put inches around your waist. This time of year, most people gain at least one pound. And here with advice on how to avoid those tempting treats and make healthier choices is Matt Bean, contributor for Eat This, Not That, Supermarket Survival Guide. Great to have you with us, Matt. Great to be here. We're going to beat the holiday bloat one meal at a time. One meal at a time. So big picture, what do you recommend? Oh, staying away from things that are holiday themed, because in many cases, they're tapping into that primal urge mm. to just let yourself go over the holidays. Let it rip. All right, so Dunkin' Donuts. Which right. do you choose that's good and which one is bad? Couple of holiday options here. We've got the warm cinnamon swirl muffin with 630 calories. Wow. Now, the first two ingredients on this bad boy are flour and sugar. No Coincident cinnamon. Coincidentally, <laughs> that's also the first two ingredients in a Twinkie. So we're going to try to stay away from this stay guy. Away. 630 is a yeah. lot for that little guy. Instead, I know it looks like a meager portion here, but we're going to go with the cinnamon cake munchkins. You're going to get uh, just over 240 calories in these guys. That's not so bad. Not bad. And also, you know, they're still holiday themed. I hop. Whew. Look at these things. <laughs> just look smell at this. Smell these things if only you could smell this them. This is the eggnog pancake ultimate sausage and bacon combo. Oh my gosh. I just gained weight saying that. I'm looking at this calorie count and it's 2,000 it, calories, 111 grams of fat. If you wanted to burn this off, you'd have to run for four hours. So obviously, uh, stay away from anything that says ultimate combo. Ultimate in combo. Instead, this is <laughs> I the always am drawn immediately <laughs> to the ultimate combo, I'll by take the way. two of those. <laughs> yeah, this is the simple and fit uh, pancake option. It's definitely a good good way to go. It's the pumpkin pancake. About a quarter of the calories is this big boy right over here. What's amazing is the two plates are not that different looking, and yet you have so many fewer calories on that one. Denny's. All right, we're going to Denny's for dinner, apparently. This is kind of a, a sad looking sandwich. Even worse, because it's 1,300 calories. It's the holiday mm turkey melt. I think it's more of a holiday hangover than a holiday leftover. <laughs> um, but there's 1,300 calories, 3,200 milligrams of sodium, which is more than you need in an entire day. So stay away from the turkey melt. Right. Instead, we've got the Super Bird sandwich, presumably because it's good for you. It's still not that great for you, about 680 calories, sorry, 635 35? calories. Um, we got some greens on there. It actually comes with broccoli when hmm. you get it. So that's sort of a healthier option okay. of the two. Mix it up a little bit. Ghirardelli, everyone loves chocolates, but Everybody loves there's candy. good and there's bad chocolate, News I guess. Newsflash, candy's bad for you. Apparently. But it's the holidays. Says you want who? to have a little bit. Um, here, we've, basically what we're saying is serving size matters. So two different uh, servings in each of these peppermint bark guys. Mm. More than 400 calories in each serving. So instead, we've got these little menagerie guys here from Lint. Cute. About 220 calories um, per four. And then I guess the Santa's just a bonus. Come on, Santa calories mm. don't count. Yeah, okay. I'm good with that. <laughs> and last, last <laughs> Starbucks. Least, Starbucks. Now, you got to order carefully at Starbucks because some of the really delicious drinks are just loaded with sugar. Here we have the eggnog latte with 690 calories. And in it a use, drink. They use real eggnog. But instead of that, we're saying make your own. In this case, we're going to do two pumps of the cinnamon syrup. Just put it in a cappuccino. You're good to go. Really? Yeah. Is it the sugar-free cinnamon syrup, or you can do either? you got to go with the, the sugar-free stuff. Yeah. All right. Good deal. Matt Bean, as Happy always. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Enjoy your holiday.